Hello everyone, this is Ian Lamont. I am the author of Google Drive and Docs in 30 minutes. Today I'm going to be talking about uh, text wrapping in Google Sheets. And just a quick reminder what I'm about to show you, it actually works in the Windows PC version of Google Sheets or the Mac OS version of Google Sheets because they're all using a browser. And it can be any type of browser, uh, Chrome, Safari, uh, Microsoft Edge, any of those things. Uh, Chrome is recommended because that's Google's own browser and Sheets and other Google programs are really designed to work in Chrome, but it doesn't matter if you're using another type of browser. This particular instruction should work the same. So here we have this uh, Google spreadsheet, and it's a bunch of reviews for a product that my company um, releases. It's actually called a uh, Excel 2019 Intermediate Cheat Sheet. And you can see that for the text, um, in some cases, the text will be cut off. Like in this one, you can see up in the function bar, there's all these little terms but they're kind of cut off right where the line is. And in other places, like on this, in this one, in the review text, um, it overflows to the next column. And maybe you want to change it so, uh, for instance, you can read everything at once without either clicking on the column or without kind of scrolling over to the, to the next column. And this is the way you do it. Uh, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to select all of the cells. Actually, let's just start with one. Let's just start with this one, uh, this particular cell. Let's say that I wanted to read everything at once. Uh, the way to do it would be to select it, then go to Format, Text Wrapping, and right now it's on Clip. That means it clips it off at the edge of the cell. Let's do it to Wrap. In Wrap, that lets you see everything at once. And then what I could do is I could just do it for the whole column. So I select the whole column, Format, Text Wrapping, and then I select Wrap. And you can see it, it did it for all of them. Now, let's take a look and see what happens when I do it for this column, the review text. Actually, let's make it a little bit easier to see. So you can see sometimes it's overflowing, sometimes it's not. And actually, the, these uh, particular cells, they're, they're set to overflow, which means that it will flow to the next cell as long as there's nothing in that cell. So in this particular cell, there's nothing there, so it just overflowed. However, in this cell right here, there's a, a URL, and um, it clipped it off there. That's kind of confusing. So let's say that we wanted to uh, you know, read everything by doing that little trick that I just showed you called wrap. Um, again, I can go to uh, select everything, go to format, uh, text wrapping, and then select wrap. That will show everything. Also, just to show you, there's actually a toolbar command on it, um, a toolbar button. Where, which one is it here? It's this one right here, text wrapping. So click on that. This means overflow. This one means wrap, this one means clip. So I'm gonna select wrap for this whole column. And you can see, now I can read everything at once. Now, one thing to notice about this is sometimes if there's a lot of text in there, it may make the cell vertically like so huge, it's actually stretching past the, uh, the top and the bottom of the screen, which may not be ideal. Like this one is too big. So uh, think about exactly if you wanna use wrap in that case. In some cases, clip may be better. Uh, but there's a couple of different options, and that's how you use them. For more information on how to get the most out of Google Sheets, check out my book, Google Drive and Docs, in 30 minutes. Again, it covers Google Sheets. It's available from in30minutes.com. My name is Ian Lamont. Thank you so much for watching.